Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Josiah Jackson here. Um, right now I am feeling pretty emotional because um, uh, something just happened uh, yesterday. Um, well, first of all, it, it was actually a really good day. You know, I my parents and I, we went to the mall and then uh, we went uh, to go sushi with uh, some friends uh, from church. But then the... Then we went to a Burlington, which is a, a store that, sh that sells uh, clothes. And I got, I got a lot to say. I got lots to, to explain what happened. <laughs> so while we were um, uh, shopping f at the Burlington, um, everything was fine. I mean, don't get me wrong. I didn't. My day wasn't ruined. So just it's, it's okay I, I feel fine well I, I don't really feel fine right now because I've been crying for like at least 25 minutes so anyhow uh, while we were um, shopping at Burlington uh, some some song that I've that, that I that I have never heard of heard of about but you know I listened to the whole thing and that that song was um, was called "My Head and My Heart" by uh, Iva Max. I did some research on that song, and uh, I mean, cheese and stinking rice. It, it was horrifying, just horrifying. It, it's just as bad as Sienna Rita, but I mean, not really as bad, but it it still is bad, you know. And and I wasn't, you know, I wasn't panicking. I wasn't crying. I'm just, I just. Even though the song, that stupid song was playing, I just, I just deal with it and just, you know, acting like, act like a human, like a normal human being in public. While, while this song is just, just, uh, it's just an abomination. And I mean, I mean that that song was so bad. It it makes me want to, you know, just hide myself under my clothes, you know, just like, you, you know what I'm talking about. Just have your like, have your arm go like. Like in this, and have your other arm go like that, and then you just hide hide your head like this. I know this may look kind of stupid, but you know that just just makes me how it how it feels when that stupid song when I first heard of that song. It's just it's just horrifying. It, it I don't like today's hits. I I don't. You guys already know. I'm I'm I love music from the fifties to like late two thousands. Yeah, like two, late two thousands. I mean, I feel like that these. These musicians, if I pronounce it right, um, these uh, Martin Day music artists, they're, they're just trying too hard. They're, they're just, they're just, they're just uh, running out of ideas, and they have lack of ideas. And even though that song was, um, I did re, re I did research on that song when I when I came home, and that that, that song came out on November nineteenth of two thousand twenty, which was last year. And I know I shouldn't be crying over a song, but that's not the point. That's not the point of the whole video. I'll explain to it um, in a moment. But I mean, I mean, I th th these no talents that it's getting bigger and it's getting worse every single year. And I just this this is why I I I just bring my um my my headphones, the, these uh, ear earpieces that you you you. Uh, you have these uh, earpieces and you plug them in, and it, it's not cordless, like like a charger. It's just like go under it, and you just put them on and just turn on the Bluetooth, and it tells you that the if the power is on, so you can listen to your own music. That's why I bring bring that around whenever I was like on the store or at the mall or at the restaurant. I mean, I mean, I, I got nothing against their their person or. I mean, I just don't like. And I just I just don't like their music and Ivan Max that that mutant who made the song I got nothing against her but I just really hate that song and this is the worst I, I don't really like that song I mean I mean I don't know what she's thinking but gosh man she definitely need to, need to be vanished in the world of Investigators three but that's not the, um, the point of this whole video though even though that did make me cry. Um, but uh, what really most important, most important, what really happened that made me cry even more when I came home 
um, while we were while we were uh, paying for our our clothes and our stuff that we brought, I, I was just waiting, and uh, my parents were talking to the cash rec the cash uh, register, and when I looked behind on my uh, my right my right, and I see this uh, woman. I'm not good at this. I'm gonna describe. Um, I think she's like um, Asian, not not to be racist or anything. I'm just just describing this this Asian woman. Um, she looked like she looked like um, my auntie Tess, and uh, you know that woman has uh, has an orange uh, dress on, not really fancy like in a wedding, but like like a gown with some flower pa uh, patterns. And I, I just I. I was trying so hard not to look away because I don't want to cry in public, but I just keep looking, looking at her, and it, and it made me remind me of my auntie Tess because she, she passed away last year, and and that that really and that really broke my heart because I I thought that woman who looked like my my auntie Tess, um, I thought she came back from from the grave, but actually that that wasn't really her in reality, but but she actually uh, looked like her. And oh man, this is this is a really hard to talk about because this is so emotional. It's get the reason why I'm I've been very emotional and I've been crying for the past like thirty minutes because I I just miss my other tests. I I I actually do. You know, next year is going to be. Uh, the year when when my auntie Tess passed away, and and I haven't seen her in in like, in like a year, almost a year now, and oh I'm not acting. I'm I'm just I'm I'm serious. This is I'm just I'm so stressed out, and I'm so sad right now because this I've I've, I've never been into this. I've been never been in to this experience before. I've never seen, I've never been into an experience where was, when I looked at somebody, like a, like a stranger, I didn't really talk to a stranger, thank God, but I just looked at him and it, and it looked like a, my family member. I've never been into that experience before, ever. And it, it, it just broke my heart. I, I tried to listen to some, some music just to get rid of that stupid song that I mentioned before, earlier in this video. But it, it it didn't help. It 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 just won't go away. It it just won't. It, it's not going away. It it just it just move. It just fades slowly. And I it, I just wanted to get that song. And that feeling, of you know, depression to go away. But it's it's moving slowly. Just slowly moving away, out of my head. And. And my day wasn't ruined. It wasn't ruined, thank God. But, gosh, I, I, I really miss my auntie Tess. I really do. I, I, I was crying. I was so emotional. And because I, I, just, I, I, was, I, just, I was so speechless. And I, I, I got nothing else to say. Except that that I love my auntie Tess so much, and I, I wonder what she's doing up in heaven. Maybe she's a, she's talking to God, and maybe she's having a tea party with my with uh, my Lola Ting, my great grandmother, and my my cousin Iris, who passed away three years ago. I mean, I, I, I couldn't stop crying. I actually couldn't stop crying because it, it, it was pretty emotional. It was a very emotional day. It went too happy, too sad. But you know what, though? It, it was it was just still a good day so far. Except that stupid song that, that, that played while we were shopping. But I, I forgot about, I forget about that song right now. It's just, it's just freaky. But 
what 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 really um made made, made my day emotional is seeing somebody that looks like one of your family members that that passed away and you just had a memory of of just hanging out with that person oh, man. so uh, i'm just uh, it's just it just i just want to let you guys know why i'm just you know emotional and just sad and just angry and, and just mixed together all three of those emotions mixed together. So anyhow, um, thank you all for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, and share it with your friends and family. Don't forget to um, follow me on my social media and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss um, a new video every day. Excuse me. And I love you all very much. I love you, and thank you for the bottom of my heart. Thank you for... Um, 186 subscribers, and I hope we'll we'll we'll, we'll get to um uh, 200 subscribers in around late around middle of July. I hope we'll make that happen, but we'll see. And 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 it's not your guys' fault that um, that made me lose uh, subscribers on my channel. It's probably the YouTube algorithm. It's probably the the stupid algorithm. But anywho, um. I, I gotta go now because I, I just I'm just gonna cry in my sleep just thinking about my auntie Tess because because I love her and I hope we'll I hope we'll talk someday when I die and go